guys, we are back, and it's the semi-finals. We are in for a treat, as we see a rematch between Barack Obama and the only man to defeat Barack Obama, Vladimir Putin. Vladimir Putin has been described as, quote, a friggin' animal, and Obama, I mean, he speaks for himself. semi-finals really uh, upsetting that nobody from round one made it but we'll make do hi everybody so glad you're with us joe tessator alongside teddy atlas and we welcome you to the mgm grand here on the vegas strip in beautiful las vegas nevada for tonight's main event Ten rounds of heavyweights. Well, they're scheduled to spend a half an hour swapping weather. This is ten round. Vicious his movements really helping him out, avoiding that punch. Wow, is he defensively sound? And he just holds on there. See him trying to cut down that tree with a well-placed right hand. That's it. Gets rid of that body shot. Very nice work to the head. The right hand landed. Vicious his punch is far off the target. A little head hunting with the right. Able to land another power shot early on. He is not in good shape. He could be on the deck in moments. Takes one, gives one. The right hand scores well. Solid uppercut. To the head he goes with a left hand. Clean shot with the right. It's okay. That's a big uppercut that just crashed home. Vicious has done a good job there offensively scoring with that left hand. We count down the final moments of this round. This round comes to an end, and Teddy, easy to note here that he wasn't landing a lot of punches. Now he was throwing them up, but he wasn't landing a lot. Is that because of his opponent's defense, or is he just not that accurate of a puncher? So it's a combination. First of all, his opponent's pretty slick in there, pretty good at bobbing, weaving a little bit, slipping a little bit, making himself a difficult target, but his punch is a little wide. Needs to shorten him up. Vicious his right hand scores well. Oh, you see him with the left of the head there? Oh, that uppercut got him badly. He's jumping all over him now. Vicious is nailed by that shot. Absolutely rocked. He could go down here, Kenny. What a crushing blow up top he just landed. That's why you don't pull straight back. Placed hook. Scored well with the left downstairs. Committing to the body work now. He lands the right hand. Here's a moment here as you see the step back counter punch where you realize this is the sweet science, not just some raw savagery swinging out. Look at the little subtleties here, Joe. What he does is he forces him into a position to stop the punch. And then when he stops, steps back, makes a miss, and comes right back. Targeting a left hand down low. Scored well up top. Wash right hand to the body.
And you see what he can do when he sends that right to the head. Vicious is getting himself into the mix now, landing that left hand. So as that round ends, it gives us pause to realize what has just taken place. And that is, we have one man who just separated himself from the other. He's able to stun his opponent, and you got to think good things are coming. Well, they've been coming for a while because I really think that those punches are benefit from a couple rounds ago. He's been hitting with a lot of punches, and I think it's starting to take its toll, and you saw it there. He scores with the left. There's that right hand he scores with. Okay, get your hands up. Able to get away from that headshot with the block. Vicious his right hand scores well that time. Now, Teddy, are you a fan of this right here? He, it seems like he's going for broke right now, where shouldn't he just be worried about getting fully recovered from what just happened? Yeah, well, that would mean that he's thinking right. He's not thinking right right now. And a right hand lands flush. There's a taste of the sweet science. You see the skill he has in counterpunching. And you know what he's doing? He's taking his opponent's jab away. Big shot. The left crashed home. Scored well with the hook. He got all into that one. That was a solid uppercut. Good shot there with that left. He comes with the straight right hand. One, two jabs up top. Vicious is on the wrong end of a razor-sharp hook. He missed with that headshot. How you doing? You okay? I need you to use your feet. Move around the ring. You got that? Okay, let's go. We come into round four here expecting a knockout. Fights don't usually go longer than four front, rounds. And I don't see this one being much time, different. Tonight. But they're still in a mode of Both just sides each have landed a lot of strikes Neither tonight. Man has Both taken sides so really doing the same thing. A very even well match. Well placed left hand there. Vicious has got a real acquired skill here, and that is the ability to pick Obama your shots connecting with a lot of so you Putin knows he's in trouble say, if he lets more of those know strikes hit. You have to know what time it is. He knows what time Big it is. Big strike to the body by Putin. To throw a certain punch. Up the cut. Oh! Putin is oh, down. Oh, that could be it. it. That was a nice hook. Go by hook or by crook. That was by hook. Hard punch. They himself open too long. Hard to prepare for a situation up. like this, but many do. He's been down, now he's got to survive. So that's where you're wrong. It's nice not hard jab to prepare, there. it's a must to prepare. Body punch. If you're a trainer, that's big uppercut, big uppercut. That's going to be the fight. To the once again. That has got to be he's it. Up before. Obama up really showing off his strength there. Obama is going to the finals from the looks of it. And yes, Obama is going is to the finals, is either against Michael Jackson up. Unable to beat the count. or The Rock. This is a dream matchup right here. What an amazing fight that was. Obama able to reclaim his legacy, and he will either fight The Rock or Michael Jackson. Semi-finals round two will also be a rematch of the finals of the placement match, where The Rock defeated Michael Jackson.